So uh, for most of my career, I've been really interested in cardiac toxicity in patients. We started using anthracyclines in patients with no negative breast cancer probably 30 years ago, and I was always concerned that we'd have delayed toxicity in those patients. And now, in my more recent interest in HER2-targeted therapy, which is clearly associated also with cardiac toxicity, I was concerned that with such life-saving treatment, we wouldn't be able to give it to patients because we would have the cardiac toxicity. And that has been the case in many of the early studies where patients have a, a, an abnormal heart function to start out with, and then you couldn't give them the HER2-targeted therapy. So the Safe Heart study took patients who had a, a lower ejection fraction between 40 and 50 percent and treated them with HER2-targeted therapy, followed extremely closely with a cardio-oncologist at our institution. And, and she evaluated these patients on a very close, regular basis and optimized their cardiac therapy. So along with that and giving them HER2-targeted therapy, we found only three patients out of 31 who could not continue their HER2-targeted therapy. So it's really very promising. It's the only data prospectively that show that you could continue this therapy in these patients and not affect their heart in most of the patients.